solve the system of linear equation in this case. We have two equations and two unknown. Uh, so what would be the best way to solve for x and y here? I'm not sure what it is, but um, I would say time time five on the first equations and multiply the second equations by two. Very good. Yeah, we can solve by addition method uh, in this case. So we need to make the coefficient of x or y opposite of each other. So here, if you want to make the coefficient of x opposite of each other, I have to multiply the top row here by 5 and bottom row here by 2. If I do that, I would get a 5 here and 2 here, and this whole equation will look like 2 times 5 would be 10x minus 35y equal to 15, and then here we get minus 10x plus 6y is equal to 14. Now since the coefficient of x was opposite of each other here, the, not, the signs were 1 minus 1 plus, uh, so we kept the numbers as both positive here. Now, if these were positive numbers, then, then we have to multiply one of these numbers by negative uh, to make sure that we have an opposite number here at the end, okay? So uh, the goal is to make the coefficient of x or y opposite of each other, and in this case, we multiply the top row by 5 and bottom row by 2. Uh, if I wanted to make the coefficient of y opposite of each other, uh, Sunit, can you tell me what, what we have to do here? Multiply the top by threes and multiply the bottom by seven. Very good. Since again the top number is negative and bottom is uh, positive, you just have to multiply the top row by three and bottom row by seven, so that would make these two opposite of each other. So in this case, uh, we already made the x uh, coefficient of x opposite, so we can proceed by adding these two. So 10x minus 10x is equal to Zero. So what do we get here, Sunit? We'll get negative 29y equal 29. Okay, so what, what do we do next? What's y? y equal negative 1. Right, we divide by 29, by negative 29. So y would be equal to negative y. So once once we find y, we can go ahead and substitute that into either of those two equations to solve for uh, for x. So if I pick the first one, I substitute for each y a negative one here for for y. Then we can simply solve for And solve for x. So we get 2x plus 7 equal to 3. So if I subtract 7, so what do we get here, Sunny? 2x equal to what? Negative 4. And x is equal to? Negative 2. Very good. So we can write as negative 2 and negative 1. These are the uh, solutions to the system of equation. Solving by addition method.